no way he's a mummy cat, but he could be a vampire cat. He's got the fangs. Last week, you thought he was a leprechaun cat. It was a reasonable theory. I'll bet anything Cat will try to ruin our sleepover tonight. There he is! I'm going after him! Maybe he's a Hydra cat. Oh, wait. He's only got one head. Or does he? Hmm. <laughs> Corn dog to double pounder. Come in, double pounder. Cat's really up to something weird this time. Over. Really? What's he doing? No way! I think Cat is sucking power from the moon. But why? From the moon? Yeah. I gotta stop him. No way! Don't go near him! to the taste. I'm telling you, I'm not turning into... Hey, where'd all my cars and action figures go? Yarn? Wind up mice? Someone's playing a trick, and I know who! <laughs> it's you! You must have done it in your sleep. The cat side of your brain is taking over already. Pretty soon, you'll be 100% wear cat! That's crazy! Crazy like a cat! <laughs> 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 kidding, kidding, I'm just kidding. Need more proof? Here you go. Aren't these old pop-up books? Shh! Sorry. Your evidence is a pop-up book. These books are meticulously researched. Besides, we don't have time to actually read anything. Look, the moon rises. Well, he's a werecat. Here's the werecat attacking his best friend. Cat boy! Everyone knows werecats were virtually eliminated by were-dogs in the 80s. Yeah, we saw it on Gassy Graves' Monster Mania in Anius show. And the Loch Ness Monster is now a lifeguard at a top-secret government water park. You don't say. Oh, your breath is toxic! Yeah, and it stinks, too. Oh, that's because Coop ate cat kibble for breakfast. <laughs> that's weird. Even for you, Burton Burger. Yeah, everyone knows that dog food tastes better. And here's the little cat eating what's left of his best friend the next day as leftovers. <laughs> okay, maybe we should play it safe. Yeah, <sighs> that should hold you. Werewolves hate silver and wolfsbane leaves, so I've got my mom's silver spoons, and I picked a bunch of pussy willows. That should be good for your particular condition. And when the change happens? If the change happens! Hook animal control. 
they'll spay or neuter you or whatever it is they do to crazy cats. <laughs> Good night. Okay. Good night. that covers this. I'll go get it and we'll have ourselves an excruciatingly uncomfortable talk. Uh, couldn't it wait until morning? Right you are, sport. Pair today, talk tomorrow and all that. Good night. Coop better have turned into a full-fledged werecat, Dennis, or you're both gonna be nerd soup. Yeah, with crackers.
That's enough excitement for one weekend. I'll see you guys later. Bye, Dennis! Dump the beard, huh? Yeah, it wasn't really me. Well, all the same, I think it's time we had a man-to-man -man talk. <clears throat> You're going to be a man soon, and your body's undergoing many, many changes. Oh. Now pay attention, sports. This is important stuff. <clears throat> Hair will soon start growing all over you, <laughs> and you may notice your clothes. Ghastly graves on the streets of Bootsville, talking to trick-or-treaters, and who do we have here? I'm the CEO of Phoebe Mart, a multi-billion dollar corporation. My mom helped me with my briefcase and quarterly reports. Boring! And who might you be, little fella? Uh, I'm Quasi... Quasi... He's Quasimodo. And I'm his hump. Dad! Halloween starting without me! Almost done, Coop! I like being a cyborg, except it's kind of hot. It's a little hard to move and... And see. So, take off the helmet for a bit? It's kind of a tight fit. It's stuck on your head, isn't it? Uh-huh. All set, Captain! Thanks, Dad! Daddy, have you seen Mr. Cat? I need to spray paint in black. I can't be a witch without a black cat. Uh, you know, honey, uh, I don't think black is Mr. Cat's color. <laughs> when fear and darkness rule the day, Captain Blasteroid is on the way! Trick or treat time! Actually, son, I think you're finally old enough to trick or treat without me. Cool! That means Daddy's all mine tonight. Double cool. Nope. Your big brother's gonna take you out this year, Millie. No! Dad, trick-or-treating on my own is a rite of passage. I can't drag my baby sister along with me. <laughs> I don't want to go with saggy pants, Coop. It's a father-daughter tradition that's very precious to me. Well, if that's what you both want. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. <coughs> Luckily, I've got all my old costumes. How about Dracula? Seen it. Frankenstein? Been there. The Wolfman? Did that. But you've never seen Baron Von Wolf Dragonstein? Maybe I should go with Coop, Daddy. God, don't be silly. I'm raring to go. But I can't find Mr. Cat or my certified genuine fake ruby necklace. Everyone knows witches get their power from rubies. They do? Okay, then. We'll take another look upstairs, sweetie. Have fun, boys! Let no house go untrick or treated! <laughs> Coop! I'm not going up there. What happened to let no house go on trick or treat it? Except that one. Come on. Ow! Whoops. <clears throat> Sorry. That ought to do the trick for the treats. <laughs> ah, here comes a test customer now. Houston, we have candy. Okay, Millie, we better go. What about? What about a sack full of mouth-watering, tooth-destroying candy? Good point. Let's roll! <laughs> uh, I've got a great idea, honey. Why don't we leave the scariest houses for last? Like this one. Oh, Daddy. Trick or treat. Oh, Millie, don't you look adorable. Aren't you a little old to be trick or treating, Burton Burger? <laughs> Guess I'm just a big kid at heart, old la uh, Mrs. Munson. <sighs> Thank you, Mrs. Munson. Trick or treat! Uh, thank you. Thank you. Sweet! Back if you hadn't stepped 
in my cape a hundred million times. Jumpa, 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 Jumpa. <laughs> Looks like Dad's candy dispenser matic is a hit. Let's go in the back. <laughs> I'm gonna so like the wind, cause time is candy. For quick mending emergencies, my mom uses a stapler. That's a great idea, Cyborg Boy! Ah! Huh? Did you see that? You're kidding, right? Either our garbage is taking itself out, or Cat is up to something big. Whoa! Why can't we just for once forget about Cat? And maybe because there's a giant laser beam shooting across town from the roof of my house? Like, I'm gonna fall for that old joke. Goop! <laughs> no! Ugh. Hey! I was here first! <laughs> what a lame robot costume. Oh, hello there. <laughs> <laughs> There's a treat for you that I want to trick from you, big fella. Well, uh, uh... Really? Have you seen a trash can come by? You just missed it. It went that way. We lost him. We'll just have to follow the laser beam. You follow the laser beam. I'll follow the candy. <laughs> <laughs> That's all there is? Cheap skates! Time to go, bro. <laughs> Did the widow babies not get any candy, Wendy? <laughs> you greedy Halloweeny! Sort of Halloween prank? What? What happened? Some kind of portal to another dimension or something just opened. Like in Captain Blasteroid rides the rocket range. Only this one isn't quite as realistic. I'll take their word for it. Cat's giving them fishy frisky bits. He's planning dinner. Or an invasion. Or an invasion of dinner guests. Oh, I miss everything. We can't take a chance. We need to ask ourselves, WWCBD. What would Captain Blasteroid do? Captain Blasteroid would stop them from getting that food and shut down that portal. Not 
so fast, my perilous friend. Candy Coop. Because I was busy saving the world from an alien invasion! Fearlessly battling off <gasps> Mr. Cat! I've been looking all over for you. You look scary. <laughs> Have a candy bar! A lollipop! <laughs> Have a crisp! Got the going, Cyborg Boy! Mayday! Mayday! I'm under attack! I repeat! I am under attack! 